From the 11th century onwards, overfishing is resulting in a considerable decrease in fish and marine mammals populations. Once depleting a specific ecosystem, the fisheries moved on to unsport areas. England is now facing the danger of overfishing. Overfishing is causing many threats to England's environment. England is surrounded by sea, so fishing is a very effective way of earning a living. Marine species, especially fish, are being threatened by both the intensity and the efficiency of commercial fishing. Marine animals, for example, sharks, rays, snakes, and many species of fish are endangered because they are long-lived and only breed later in their lives. So fishing these animals can cause a huge decrease in their population. Connolly, who is the Director of Fisheries Science Services at the Marine Institute in Galway, said, continuous overfishing has led to a collapse in cod in both these areas. The signs have been that every year the scientists have repeatedly warned poachers must be cut, but fishery ministers have time and time again ignored us. We do not know now whether the stocks will recover. Overfishing has caused enormous changes in our oceans as well. Scientists fear that it will never recover. Now over 90% of large predatory fish, such as cod and tuna, have already been caught. Fishermen are now forced to look for fish further down the food chain, as 70% have decreased the marine animals have decreased the marine Over 70% of the world's fisheries are either fully exploited, overexploited, or significantly depleted. Some species have already been fished to commercial extinction and more are on the verge of extinction, so the United Nations. Scientists are already warning that the oceans will suffer profound changes as a result of overfishing and destructive fishing practices. The depletion of fisheries is becoming more important. A number of international agreements on oceans and fisheries have been signed. Many large fishing boats have tried to take a biologist along to ensure they are respecting international fishing rules. Commercial fishers have resisted quota and moratorium rules. Many of the agreements are difficult to enforce and lack penalties that could truly serve as deterrent. Another way in which overfishing can be lowered is by placing no fishing signs up in areas where marine animals are in danger. We can help these rules by respecting them and telling other people not to fish or overfish in, in these areas and other areas around us. We can report people who disobey the laws of new fishing. Here's a public who swim, fish and spend a day at a week help by respecting our environment. We could throw our garbage in the bin while in the sea. Like we know, marine animals can mistake our garbage for food. While overfishing is a threat to marine biodiversity, there are many other things that also lead to the death of many marine animals, such as oil leaks from boats and many other things. If we change our ways, we can help our population of marine biodiversity grow. We can change it if we make a change ourselves.